the Prince of Wales is first in line to the throne and is expected to take over after the Queen. Since Prince Philip's death and after the Queen turned 95 this month, questions have been raised over who will take over as head of the firm. As the first in line to the throne, Charles reportedly has a new vision of what the future of the British monarchy will look like. A source told US Weekly, Charles is working toward a new slimmed-down monarchy and is freezing Harry out. He's actually already out. After the damage Harry has caused the family, he firmly believes that his son doesn't deserve the privilege of being a royal. Tensions have reportedly risen between Harry and his father after the Duke and Duchess of Sussex sat down for a tell-all interview with Oprah Winfrey last month. Harry told the US chat show host that Charles and his brother William are trapped within the system of the firm. The source said, to put it bluntly, it's unlikely that we'll be seeing Harry and Charles making amends anytime soon. The insider added that Charles is still fuming about the Oprah interview and won't let it drop. Harry returned to the UK earlier this month for his grandfather Prince Philip's funeral. He joined Charles, William and other members of the royal family in attending the service at St George's Chapel in Windsor. According to reports, Harry and his father have not mended their relationship. The source added, but to be honest, Harry didn't go running back to Charles begging for forgiveness either. He still hasn't forgiven his father for his lack of effort and support after he and Meghan decided to move. The reason Harry went back to the UK was to see the Queen and to pay his respects to Prince Philip. That's about as far as it goes.